New at 11 tonight, we are hearing from the man who was part of the school board in Virginia Beach where a middle school student was suspended for shooting a toy gun in the child's own yard. This is school board chairman Dan Edwards. We wanted to ask him questions about the decision to suspend Khalid Caraballo and two friends from Larkspur Middle School because they played with airsoft guns in Caraballo's front yard 70 yards from the bus stop. When we asked administrators for a statement, Edwards sent one via Twitter last week, which said the school system was responding to a threat to student safety. The statement also revealed Khalid's previous disciplinary problems. Ten on your side's Aaron Kelly went to tonight's school board meeting to ask Edwards about that and more. Aaron? Well, we had a lot of questions. What motivated the school system to release Khalid's disciplinary record to the public? What about Khalid's family's claims that releasing the information amounts to cyberbullying? Well, here's what we found out. 13-year-old Khalid Caraballo and his two friends got a four-month suspension last month from Larkspur Middle School. Administrators claim the students were shooting at people near a school bus stop with an airsoft gun. Later, school board chairman Dan Edwards released Caraballo's private disciplinary record over Twitter. Why did you release those records to the I public? I don't have any comment. We pressed Edwards on that before a school board meeting Tuesday night. What's the motivation in releasing those records? Why not send that information to us directly? Why put that out there publicly? That's the question we're trying to get answered. Edwards' online statement says he thought the school system could release the disciplinary record because, quote, Ms. Caraballo signed a waiver and chose to make this a public conversation. You are not commenting any further on the case. Why not? Why because releases? the case is completely resolved. But Colleen's mother says her son was on private property when using the airsoft gun. Good evening. She calls Edward's release of her son's record cyberbullying. She says she didn't sign the waiver to authorize the school to release that, only the incident with the airsoft gun. No news media asked him to say, oh, well, what about Khalid's past record? Nobody asked him. So this isn't news media, this is social networking. And this is cyberbullying. What about the mother saying that this is cyberbullying? She has an entitlement to her opinion. So if it is over, we ask the board, what's next? Can Khalid appeal? A spokeswoman said no. It was a unanimous decision. It was a unanimous decision? Okay. I'm not discussing it. Until a hearing in January, Khalid will be homeschooled. Now, we still have not received any evidence from the school board or discovered any on our own showing Khalid ever left private property when using the airsoft gun. Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.